Welcome back to the latest episode of Roman Found. This is Lucy. And this is Ellie. Let's get into it. So where are we today? Which field are we in? Um, this is the cow field. Oh, it is the cow field, isn't it? The friendly cows. The, inc- the two friendly cows. Yeah. They wouldn't leave us alone. They were obsessed with us. They are obsessed with a pinpointer. And they thought it was a carrot, didn't they? Because it's so bright orange. <laughs> oh, and there was a bull in the field as well, wasn't there? Yeah, he was well scary. The grass is so long. Why are we digging in such long grass? Oh, Do we I think dig it was just summer. Kind of Everything was just growing oh, so quickly. It was so lush, wasn't it? What have we got? Is it a coin? I can see that, I can see that edge. I remember it being edible the 7th, I think. It was our first one, wasn't it? Yeah, our first ever one, a little half penny. Yeah, that one had been like, like had been clipped by the plough and you thought you'd done it. I did think I'd done it, yeah. <laughs> you thought you'd put the spade I was so it. worried. Well, it's the first one we'd ever found that had been broken. Was, yeah, we've been quite lucky, yeah, really. We have been. 1907, I think that one was, if I remember. We're like slowly ticking off all the monarchs, aren't yeah. we? One day we will have found every single monarch in British history. I mean, that's We're the goal. There. That's the goal. <laughs> that's the dream. I mean, look at his little head. Lovely little bust on it, even though his little neck's been... Um, Lacerated. <laughs> He's been decapitated. He's been slightly decapitated. That's me. Oh, the nettles. Regretting not wearing leggings. I oh, know. I'm, I'm not, <laughs> probably crying. <laughs> I mean, I'm also in shorts. I'm having to kneel in them. The woes of our summer digging. Yeah, wear leggings, basically. I think. Don't go in shorts. Not a good idea. Yeah, we learned very quickly about that, didn't we? We're both in shorts here and we both suffered. What have we got here? Can you see something? I can see it. There we go. Oh, oh it's a coin. Yeah, and this is probably my favourite coin reveal. Yeah, I think so as well. It's such a good, it's such a good little edit. I mean, the way that dirt just oh, oh. plops off like that. And then his head as well, just yeah. perfect. This one's in really nice condition. It cleaned up really well, this one. I think it's, is it 37, this one? I think so. I, I'm not very good at remembering dates, but I think I can well, read that on the coin there. He's George VI. He's lovely. He's the king's dad. <laughs> the queen's dad. Oh, the queen. The queen's dad, not the king. The queen's dad. Oh, we dug everywhere in this field, didn't we? We went all around the edges, everywhere. We thought we'd find a lot around the boundary. Mm. Oh, this was a weird one. I think oh. we're still not quite sure exactly what it is, but some kind of little box or little case. But it was in so many pieces. Or like a book case. Like a or about like a wallet, like a passport holder. I don't know. It's so strange. Very decorative. It wasn't any nice metal. No. Had, no, nothing nice would have splintered like it that. It was literally falling to pieces as we were pulling it out. It came out the hole in about 57,000 pieces. Oh, that's a big chunk of it. Look. I think <laughs> is, that, is that the bit with the hinge on? I think the hinge was just floating around in the hole. I mean, if anyone's ever seen one of these before, leave us a comment because we were a bit stumped by it. We've still we? got it. We've still got we're it. We're still hoarding it. <laughs> we don't know what it is, but we've still got it. Oh, is this another coin? It looks like I can see that. Beautiful green. Actually, I don't know if this one is my favourite coin reveal. Oh, this one. It's between those two, I think. They're the colour of the pennies. Even though they're not particularly old, I just love What shall like we the say? Of them. As long as it's not in current circulation, we're happy. Yeah. We're happy for digging I it. I mean, a coin's a coin. A coin's a coin. Look. The detail look on Britannia. it is just, like, stunning. Absolutely stunning. This one's also in really nice condition. It came out of the ground really clean as well. Yeah. I mean, I can get excited about a good penny find yeah it's because you don't know this this oh. coinage do you <laughs> <laughs> used to those new zealand dollars oh this is the oh god you've seen a snake here and you went all <laughs> david snake. there was a snake just curled, curled up right there well, I'm, wildlife i'm watch. gonna capture it one day <laughs> oh is this bit is this bit of pocket watch do you think i think so we've never quite decided but no. i think it is a some sort of watch face mm. or it's something that moves, because the, the notch at the front would have knocked something, surely. Well, I could have made that up and enough about watches. <laughs> That's my best guess, anyway. We need a watch expert we to do need a tell watch us expert. about that one. Drop us a comment, let us know what it is. Give us your knowledge. Always here to learn. We're digging away for something here. Do you think it's going to be trash or treasure? I put this edit together. <laughs> <laughs> you should know. I can't remember. You can't it. remember. What I'm struggling, for? struggling to find it. Yeah. I'm rummaging. Oh, there it oh, is. Oh, there it is. Oh. Oh, it was a coin. What uh, is it? It looks like a pound to I me. I think that's... Uh, it's funny how the most modern coins do not last well, do they? No. But like, look at the state of that. I think the metal just must be really bad. It's because it's a mixture of metals, whereas like older ones are more pure metals. Like, it'll be more like I don't think silver. anyone will ever find them in the future. Oh, no, there's no way they'll... They won't last 2,000 years like the Roman coins. No way. 
We we will never be the Romans, will we? We no thought this was a Roman. <laughs> <laughs> Just a lovely bolt. You'll find bolts in the future. They're better metal than coins are. Yeah. That'll be all that's left of our civilization. That's another. And look at the state of that. What two p? Two p. Probably again, nineteen ninety seven. Most crusty thing I've ever seen. I feel like after de decimalization, the coin swept down. You'll never find them in the future. Even if you do, they'll just be lumps of iron. Mm, yeah, what a crusty little thing that is. Crusty little bugger. What's going on here? What's oh, that? that was another one of those. Oh, it was like, it's, are they like doorknobs or bedposts? I uh, know, we found one in the last video. This one's in a bit, is a bit grotty, this one. It's slightly different, I think. I mean, it's falling to pieces as well. Yeah, it's full of dirt. Absolutely destroyed. Well, we were very near some abandoned cottages, weren't we? Mm. So it could be from those. Caused a lot of debate on TikTok, that one, didn't it? Oh, it did. It caused some, <laughs> caused some drama. And look at us eating our break. lunch. We always bring a little pack up with us. What have we got here? Do you reckon there's going to be any... Right, trash or treasure? <laughs> I'm going to go trash. Ooh. Treasure. Treasure? Fingers crossed. We always play this little game in the field, don't we? Really dig something. <laughs> yeah. Trash or treasure? It's mm, okay. Modern tempe. Would we say that's trash or would we say that's treasure? I mean, that one's actually in pretty good neck. We could spend that one. I think it must be more recent. Whack it in the ultrasonic cleaner. We'll spend that in Asda. I could, <laughs> I could buy our next lunch. Pay for next lunch. Pay yeah. for next. I think didn't we find like one pound twenty six on this dig or something? Yeah. I remember finding a lot of coins, Cash a lot of modern in. ones. Cash it all in. What we got here? Oh, oh a little a, button. Yeah, he was quite lovely because he saw the... You can read it. It was a Savile Row Savile one. Row. We need to find out what tailor it is. It was quite hard to... It was hard to work out in the field. I tried researching that one. Yeah. It was hard to find out. The address doesn't have much about it. No. See, look, that copper one looks exactly like the Tempe. And the Tempe is like a silver colour one. That's probably adding to our £1.26 total. That one's quite an old one because it's like the old Queen's bus. So it'll be at least... What, 80s? 80s, yeah. That's still not very old. For no. our lifetimes, at least. And then this was our last find of the day. Oh, it was the last find of the day, and the best find of the day. That always seems to happen. It's, it's a bit of a bit of a way of life for Roman found, isn't it? Yeah. We never find treasure till the very, very end. End of the day. It's like the last hole that we dig. As dusk is setting in. Oh, yeah. We had no idea what this was when we found it. I mean, just look, what do you think We'd that is? We never found one before. And we never found something so good so far down. About two foot deep, this one. Well, usually, like, we find horseshoes about there. Yeah. Kind of depth. Horseshoes, bits of plough. But as soon as we saw the that, that, that green, green, you like, know. Yeah, we we're like, oh. So you see that green is like... We need to be a little bit more careful. With immediately the spade goes away and the comedy trial comes out. And we start <laughs> gently teasing the dirt Excavating away. Excavating Excavating. I mean, we barely find artefacts. Like, it's no. not often for us to find an artefact. It's always, this was just like, it's always nice, isn't it? Yeah. It's something a bit different to research. We got a bit excited, didn't we? It was we? immediately like... This is something good. You can feel it in our bones. <laughs> you can see how gently I'm teasing it out. That comedy trial does does do its worth, doesn't it? <laughs> it is, it is quite it's good, good. It's good for teasing out those finds. Good old Amazon. It's just deep in there, look. Ooh. Deep down. Needs a bit more a bit, bit excavating. More, bit more excavation. And it was at a bit of an angle, wasn't it? Wasn't yeah, it? it was hard to get the camera down. <laughs> <laughs> it was hard to get the camera down. Oh! She's free! Oh, look at her. What a beautiful buckle. Have we ever found one as nice since? We've no. found a few now. We have but. found a few buckles now, but that is the... That's our best. Is that our oldest oh, wow. one? No. Not, not our oldest no. one. Not we'll our oldest to, one. We'll have to wait for that episode. Wait for that. Wait for that update. <laughs> but this is pretty old. One of my favourites, I think. So the, the date of those is... Turned out to be Tudor. It was 1550 to 1650. Yeah, that's right. Absolutely stunning. Look at it. I think the design of, of it is what I like, like the acorn motif. It's yeah. a very Tudor symbol. Well, it's complete. Incredible. Each of the four little po points are little acorns, aren't they? Little moulded acorns on each corner. There was a lot of, like, myth around oak trees. Yeah, the symbolism, things. isn't it? So Interestingly, a similar date to one of our next upcoming finds. Something a bit Which more special that? that we've got coming up. Maybe something a little bit silver. Ooh. Maybe on our next video. <laughs> I think that was it for the day though, wasn't it? Yeah, last haul. That was our last haul. Last find. Thanks again for watching. Remember to like, comment and subscribe if you want to see more of our finds.